So we've just spent the last two nights in Blackpool. So we had a full day yesterday. Obviously we arrived the day before. Um, so I decided to start the vlog today because we are going into the Pleasure Beach and it's quite exciting because it's the first day of opening. Usually we come to Blackpool about, you know, mid-February to be honest with you for the WOW weekends. But for some reason this year, the Pleasure Beach didn't actually open until today which is actually i said the second of march today second yeah. of march so yeah we're a little bit later than usual but we've decided to stay in the boulevard actually it was tim's idea i mean sometimes we stay in the big blue sometimes we stay in the premier inns because believe it or not the premier inns are nice as well between me and you the boulevard is lovely, but I do still prefer the big blue. Um, I probably shouldn't be saying that at this point in the vlog, but it is a lovely hotel. It's really, really nice. But I don't know, I just, the big blue has some lovely memories for me. I really love the layout of the rooms. Well, when you stay in the deluxe rooms, they are slightly different to the standard. So I do like the layout, but, but yeah, the boulevard is nice and it's the sister hotel. And we've got a view of the park as well so this is the view from our window they actually look like doors but they're not they're just designed to look you know like doors but the windows which is great for me because i really panic with casper with things like that the weather it's not as bad as yesterday yesterday was really rainy and really dull and it was freezing yesterday ultra freezing so today doesn't look too bad. It's got potential. It might brighten up. The plan is let's go get some breakfast, set ourselves up for the day. And then we're going to go to take this little man <laughs> to the Pleasure Beach. Which means that because it's me, Tim and Gasper, it's going to be baby rides all day. Unless one of us goes on our own on a roller coaster. But I don't think I'll be going on my own on a roller coaster. Yeah, so milk. Yeah, yeah she said she'd get a jug for the table. I can tell by the colour of it. Do you want me to try a bit? <laughs> oh, this is well nice in here. Yeah. Oh, it's like a buffet. They've got... Um, a continental breakfast option here so you don't get a little menu in the big blue do you i, I, I shouldn't compare it to the big blue all the time but i do yeah, oh, yeah, we, like yeah coffee, we having coffee <laughs> i love these chairs though they feel these feel really really chic don't they yeah thank you is it yummies is it yummies so Casper's got a matching jumper to me. I'm not wearing mine today, but I've got the same at home. Oh, oh, I've got a bib in my bag. I come prepared, Daddy. Right, get me get the bib because I've got a bib. Um, Casper, do you want Mummy to put some honey and some butter on that? Excuse me. Can I put a tea, please? Sure. Thank you. Casper, let me let me put some honey on that. Casper's got a nice bit of honey on his toast, which is going to go absolutely everywhere. I like the way that when um, we went up to go and get the breakfast, um, someone was putting the items on there for you, so there weren't everyone swapping everything about. Yeah. There's no teaspoons. I noticed that. Yeah, no <laughs> yeah. They'd probably give you one if you asked though, wouldn't they? Because they're but really good service. I know you'd think it'd just come with a cup, wouldn't you? What 
we do without these sugars at breakfast? We would be lost, wouldn't we, without these sugars? Oh, not the floor. Not the floor. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Not that. Not that. No. No. <laughs> We knew it was going to be like baby rides all day, but the first ride is the Eddie Stone Park truck. Here we go, choo choo. Here we go, Casper. <laughs> On the Eddie Stone Park ride. <laughs> I know, that's the whole point of this ride, isn't it? The music. Santa and Daddy got do, a do super on. cool <laughs> ass or adora. Do, 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 swipe no swipe in. Dinky Dora, Dinky Dora, Dinky 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 Dora. Dinky Dora. <laughs> <laughs> he likes it though, Daddy. It's good. We've wanted to take you on this for ages, Dumpies. But but we wanted to take you on here with the music. <laughs> Hello. Uh, well, I know he'd love. Hola. Play the music on your phone. Huh? Play the music on your phone. Uh, well, by the time I get that up, the ride will be over. <laughs> Otherwise, I would. Casper. Cab. This goes too fast. I couldn't go on this. This will make me feel sick. This is great fun. Where are they? There they are. Whee! Here they come. Whee! It's going so bloody fast. going round, 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 round. And I woke up with a massive headache, not alcohol related, might have just had. But I've took paracetamol and I've prayed them. And it's, yeah, it's not as bad as it was, but it's still there. So going on anything spinning is a great big no-no for me right now. I think he enjoyed that. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Daddy. Hello, Daddy. Well, this is a nice place to have a cuppa. I'm actually having a hot chocolate. It's so cold and wet and damp outside that I just needed to warm up to so come to an indoor calf just outside of the Pleasure Beach. It's actually attached to the Pleasure Beach. Just to warm up and uh, chill out for five minutes. We've met so many people today. So many people have come up and said hello. It's been really really lovely overwhelming really nice and yeah it's just been 
just been a jam-packed day, which we weren't really expecting. It was nice to take the people because it was so wet. Yeah. Outside, it was horrible. Usually when we see people as well, it's literally like when we're on the go doing a live and it's just like hi and bye to people. So you try and be polite, but obviously you're on the move and stuff and you're doing a live. So it's really nice to be able to chat to people today. I love the fact that we get Yorkshire tea everywhere. Well, I'm having a hot chocolate, so mine's not Yorkshire tea. Nice view though. I swear this used to be a restaurant like when we yeah, first started coming here years ago. Yeah, See the Velvet Coaster. We wanted coaster. to come up here and stay up, uh, eat up here, but we never did. Because yeah. it's quite expensive. Well, you, yeah, I don't think we could ever afford it. In fact, can you see the travel lodge just out the window? When me and Tim first came to Blackpool together, probably about 13 years ago, we stayed in that travel lodge the first night, got a KFC takeaway, didn't we, when we arrived? Yeah. We met it in the room and then came to Pleasure Beach for the day. But before we started our trip at the Pleasure Beach, we went over to the pier opposite the Velvet Coaster. That was before Weatherspoons was a thing to have breakfast. Yeah, there was no Velvet Coaster then. And we had a bacon roll <laughs> on the pier before coming over here to the Pleasure Beach. We'd be lost without sugars, wouldn't we? <laughs> Look, we they sliced them all up on there. <laughs> wow! It's playing sugar shop. Oh, I love that. So it's actually raining cats and dogs outside, and I'm not joking. It's been torrential rain pretty much the majority of the day. So we've had our hot chocolate tea break when it didn't rain, so we timed that brilliantly. So we thought we'll run for a ride that's got a little bit of shallow, which there are very few. Oh, and goodness. that's brought us to the River Caves, which we had to queue for because everyone had the same idea. Puppies! I can't catch his face. Is that new? The ceiling? Hey. I've never seen the ceiling like that before. I don't know, I can't remember. Yeah, this all looks like it's been... This has got a bit of a Van Halen vibe, hasn't it, really? It was surprises you, but I think it is in here, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I know, right? It's clever how they do it. Oh, by the way, there is a little bit of a dip in here at the end, so I think that bumps me all right on Wallace and Bonnet. Uh, yeah, I know which one you're on about. There was definitely one um, in Disneyland. Ooh. I don't remember seeing them women down there before. I just had to go and get some donuts. So I've um, introduced a little bit of uh, dairy to the diet. Having a couple of donuts, and I just got them from my candy. Could do with a bit of sunshine though. How typical though, it's a really nice day though. And yesterday was torrential rain. That would have been so nice, this weather yesterday. That is the problem with Britain. You never know what you're gonna get. It's like a box of chocolates. I'm waiting for the big ones to come down that great big steep track. So strange because I've felt terrible like 
yeah, looked last and dress, felt terrible. Red lipstick. You just got, you just got the perfect amount of makeup. You don't overdo it like some women do. Oh, thanks, darling. And that's why I married you because you say all the right things. Bumpies, come here. Have you enjoyed your stay in Blackpool? Isabel. He's off. He's had a great time on the rides. So the plan now is to go and get breakfast. It feels like I just focus on having breakfast all the time. I'm not one of these people that just sit and have breakfast and binge and stuff like that. Sometimes I'm just happy with nothing or just a coffee. So, but it does seem like I have breakfast all the time, but we're traveling home today. We do need to get something. So I think the plan is, I'm gonna double check with the other half. But I think the plan is to go to the Velvet Coaster. We actually haven't been at the Velvet Coaster since we arrived and we arrived Thursday evening and it's now Sunday morning. So I think that's the plan. Yeah. Is the big one going up? Yeah, it is, it's going up. I don't think anyone's on it though. Oh, you can't see from here, it go down the steep bit. I got it wrong. So I thought this was, <laughs> I've lost my bearings. I thought this was the big steep bit, but that's the bit where they go up. So I completely got that wrong. When I was going around yesterday and we were speaking to people, I was referring to it as Pepsi Max. I really need to get with the program. Come on. We're waiting. There she goes. Still nobody on it. You should tell people how long it's taken me to edit this video to put the thumbnail up and to then publish. Feels like forever. Are we ready, Fumpy? Should we go get some breakfast? Should we go get some breakfast? Should we go get breakfast? Yum, yum, yum. The weather is so nice and we're just walking past the pleasure beach and we wish it was yesterday. Why? So it's just not fair, is it? Normally in February, the weather, every time we've come, every time we've come for the years, it's always had it sunny. Yeah. Like this. Yesterday was an absolute washout. We um we cut the day short because we were like going to go on some more rides. We were like, we're battling this rain. Let's just get back. And I don't know, we just felt like a bit cold, wet and damp. So we decided not to go out last night. Had an evening in and just a chilled one. And that was quite nice. So we don't usually do that. We usually always go out for a meal, but yeah, I, we just weren't feeling it at all. And we really gutted because we wanted to take funds to the sandcastle on the Friday. And obviously we didn't realise that it's weekends only. We thought it was open all the time. The Blackpool season used to start in February for the WOW weekends. So I think we kind of thought, okay, the Pleasure Beach is closed and isn't open until March. But I don't think we realised that the rest of the stuff in Blackpool, but we did realise when we arrived that actually nothing is open until the Pleasure Beach is open. But it's a lovely morning for a walk. It's always very depressing, isn't it, when the weather is really nice and you've got to go home. Yeah, that nice. Well, you're actually debating staying. I can't believe I'm saying this, but I'm hot walking. <laughs> I think I feel like I'm too wrapped up. Well, let me grab the door. Thank you. Where do you want to sit? Oh, it's well hot in here. Oh, 
let's go and see what the sea is like today in Blackpool. Is it rough? Is it choppy? Is it still? It's a nice day. We can't really see from up here. There's a lot of wind turbines out there. That's the South Pier. We actually haven't been on the pier. We've run out of time as per normal. Can't fit everything in when you come here. In the distance, you can just see the mirror ball. Tim proposed to me in front of the mirror ball. We couldn't afford the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> I assume that the um, the big one's not working again today. It wasn't working yesterday. It wasn't operating. I saw it go round empty from the boulevard. That's the hotel we stayed in, just over there. But I could see out of our window it was going round empty, like they were having a little bit of a test run this morning. And I haven't actually seen it run since, so I'm assuming it's not working. Because yesterday when it wasn't working, we were saying to people, is it not working because of the weather? Because the weather was really bad yesterday, but people were saying, no, it's a technical fault. And well, you can't blame the weather today because it's really nice. So it looks like they've still got a technical fault, which doesn't really bother me because I couldn't really go on it with Casper anyway. And I've been on it so many times before. Tim said to me a little while ago, shall we just book another night? And I was like, oh, I'm so tempted. but. No, he doesn't. He's tired as well. How do you feel about going home? It's always really disappointing, isn't it? Yeah, well, I was going to say to you if you wanted to stay. This is like a VIP kind of angle looking at the park, would you not say? Because obviously this is the car yeah, park well, for the boulevard. Park. Yeah, so there's the big drop on the big one. It's like the coaster goes up. I can't show you it now because it's not running. We don't know why. And then usually it drops you from there and goes all the way down. And unless you're parked at the boulevard and stay in here, you don't really get to see it from this angle. So a VIP outlook view, a VIP view. You what, Bumps? You got something to say? <laughs> yeah, Dad loaded the car, didn't he? Um, this is what normally happens. I just do all the packing and Gabby just stands. Did a great job, though. Stands around well, looking good. Did a great well, job, baby. Thanks. Did you get that jam off your arm? Yes, Puppy's yes, had some toast and jam when we had breakfast. He got jam oh, on his Dad. fingers. And what did you do? Put them straight on Tim's yeah. white jumper. Do not wear a white jumper if you have a toddler. Yes. I made that mistake though. Like my white coat that I bought from New Look, my winter one, gets trashed all the time. Yeah. White is lovely, but it's not good. So that's it. Bye bye Blackpool. Hopefully you've all enjoyed this vlog. If you have enjoyed it, then please give this a thumbs up hit the subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification, notification bell. bell i have filmed blackpool before um a couple of years ago so do check out that vlog um and see if things have changed a little bit in the last couple of years but anyway for now i'll catch you soon should we get a coffee yes let's get a coffee oh that looks nice what's that at the same time Ooh, things are getting snazzy. Oh yeah, but we'd need to hire a cleaner, Tim, because I ain't cleaning. <laughs>